All right, what's up, YouTube? Welcome back to another Reason tutorial. Today, I'm going to be showing y'all how to make like a bouncy guitar melody. So we're going to start off with this ample guitar, send me hello. All right, I'm going to grab the pencil tool and I'm going to lay some notes down in G minor. All right, so now we're going to take this, select it, hit Command D to duplicate it. And then we're going to select the whole melody and bring it up two octaves and then shift it over like one eighth. All right, I'm going to go in here and change some of these notes around to get a different feel. So now I'm going to switch lanes and I'm going to add some counter melodies. All right, I'm going to go in here and I'm going to change this last note. And I'm going to set the velocity. All right, then I, I use some portal. I don't really use this. I just wanted to see what it sound like. Alright, so I'm going to go down here and I'm going to bounce both of these lanes, trim them up, snap them back on the grid. Alright, now I'm going to go up here and I'm going to fade these out and I'm going to normalize it and bring the volume down. All right, so we're going to go inside the arcade and we're going to lay this little guitar thing down. We can move on to the drums. We're going to start with the hi-hats. I'm going to go in here and, uh, you know, switch the measurements up. Get some hi-hat rolls going. All right, I might be going extra with the hi-hats, but I'm just showing you different ways you can do it. All right, I'm gonna just go in here and I'm gonna, um, I'm gonna change the ending. I'm gonna put a different pattern. So now that we got that down, we're gonna go down here and add two more lanes for the clap and the counter snares.
All right, so now I'm gonna go down here. I'm gonna add three more lanes, and I'm gonna add like an open hi hat, two more perks, you know, like a bell sound or something. All right, so we're going to move on to the 808s. We're going to add a new lane, select the ghost notes so we can place these 808s on the right key. So I'm going to go in here and I'm going to change this to 132 and I'm going to put like a 808 roll. Alright, I'm gonna just add some more stutters on these 808s. Alright, so now we're going to do the reverse 808. We're going to go in here and grab the wave file and bring it into the session. Then we're going to reverse it, uh, bring the volume down a little bit, fade it in, and just move it over here. Now we're going to hold option and bring it in a little bit, make it shorter. And right here, I just added some saturation. Alright, now right here I just use Effectrix for the transition for when the beat turn around. 